Good luck to Connections in the Liver Mile Classic Group 1. We're set. Let's bring it on. Gates open, they're off in the Liver Mile Classic. St. Emilian was one of the first away from Authentic Paddy. Going forward in the early stages, Bohemian Lily and sliding forward also the Stablemates battle time and Farm Boy widest of all as they come down past us their first occasion. That'd be followed out next and behind these, Humidor settles three wide. In the centre, Hassel Hoof and Jelinski Prince. Then came Rasa Lilla, she's immediately away from the rail. On her outside is Mime Court three wide with cover around that first bend. Then came El Pescado, Savaria, Willie Cazales and Benzini. They head down towards the 1500 metres and St. Emilian at a steady tempo takes the lead now from Battle Time who's fired up three wide. Celebrity Miss the inside gets the perfect run and in the centre authentic Paddy. Farm Boy no luck as well three wide on the back of the stable mate. Uh, then followed round and behind these at the 1200 metres mark by Hassel Hoof and Bohemian Lily. Humidor's back midfield from over on the inside is Jelinski Prince. A length away then Mime out deeper followed by Platinum Command then Rasa Lilla she's back fourth left, fifth last here two links away El Piscado then Benzini Savaria and Willie Cazelle's the last two but it's a compact field in the liver mole there's only eight links first to last they head to the 850 meters St. Emilian tackled by Authentic Paddy Humidor's worked round out three wide Mime is right there as well in taking shortcut Celebrity Miss Hasselhoof is next Jelinski Prince in between runners Girasa Lilla she's stalking them she's only four links off the leaders followed then by Bohemian Lily under a bit of a ride further back then is El Piscado, Willie Cazales, then battle time gave ground with the well back Benzini, with them also as they come to the corner was Farm Boy and then Savaria and Platinum Command homeward bound they are in the liver mole 350 to go and Mime the leader out coming through on the inside, Humidor Russell is out after them, El Piscado's out wide and Willie Cazales appearing at the 150 Humidor, Willie Cazales and Russell Lilla out wide El Piscado Willie Cazales and Humidor Humidor the two, Humidor, Willie Cazales trying to pick it up, Humidor just in front, Willie Cazales lunged and might have got it, right on the line Willie Cazales, Humidor and Hasselhoof has flown late to be third, in behind them next we had Rasa Lilla in a photo with uh, St. Emilian and also El Piscado. Then further back in the field next was Jelinski, Prince, Benzini, Mime. Further away, Authentic Paddy. Then came Savaria. Uh, with those as well as they went across the line would have been Battle Time, Platinum Command, Celebrity Miss, Bohemian Lily, and back with them also, Farm Boy, Willie Cazales, the former Hong Kong galloper, and Craig Grills. I've got it, I reckon, right on the line from a very game, Humidor. Hasselhoof has arrived late, will take third. Look at the big grey out in the centre of the track, Willie Cazales. Gee, they've been backing this horse with the feature futures market for a little while. From the Lance O'Sullivan, Andrew Scott team, Craig Grills, Humidor was trying hard, Hasselhoof was right there, but Willie has stretched the neck and I think he'll get up. Yep, Willie Cazales will win the Livermore Classic. Humidor second, Hasselhoof third. El Piscado will be fourth just ahead of Rasalilla. Willie Cazales will take out the Livermore Classic. He sat back, he had the best pass form leading into the race and he takes it out. Here's the judge. Eight, Hasselhoof third. Six, El Piscado fourth. Eleven, Rasalilla fifth. One, Benzini six. Four, nine, eight, six, eleven, one. Time 209.75.